Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hey what's up? My name is Caitlin and today we're going to be doing my Glam Bag Plus unboxing. Um, Ipsy has now three subscription services. You can do the normal little bag, the Glam Bag Plus, or the Glam Bag Ultimate. Stay tuned for that. I do have that coming soon. But this is the middle tier guy and this one retails for $25 a month. You get five, sometimes six I think, full size, deluxe size products in there. So let's go ahead and dive right into this guy. So, again, it's the same as the other little Ipsy card that you get in here. It's the Flaunt It card, but this does have all of the products listed on it. So we're not gonna look at that quite yet. On the inside, it says Discover Yourself. And they have orange paper in this time. Normally you get yellow. Then opening it up, this is what we see. So it looks like We've got a Betty Boop bag. I do appreciate it's a different bag. Um, I have the other one right here in front of me. This is the one from the little Ipsy and this is the bigger one. So it does have a little Betty Boop right here on the side. The back is sequins again and they are reversible it looks like. Are they all black though? Yeah, just like a matte black or a shiny black. My hair's getting caught. And the zipper has got a little heart, which I think is super cute. Um, I said this in my other Ipsy, but my grandma used to adore Betty Boop, so I'm probably going to give this one to her as well. Okay, so first thing right off the back that I'm not excited about is this. This is by Dr. Brandt. It's the Microdermabrasion Age Defined Exfoliator. I would be stoked about this if it were cruelty free, but it is not. And you guys know I don't use non cruelty free products. so. It is a cool product to get, but not something I'll be using. That retails for $79. Okay, that's a lot of money. Next thing in here is this guy here. This is the Betty Boop thing. Um, in every box you get, no matter what size, or if you get the bag, you are gonna get a Betty Boop product in there from the collection. And this is the one I got. It is the Cheek to Cheek Blush Palette. I do believe for one of the boxes, I don't know if it was this one or the big one, I got to choose this product, but I also know, spoiler alert, I have this product in my big box too, because Ipsy did reach out to me and let me know that they <laughs> sent me the same product in both boxes and that they would uh, credit me some coins, coins, some Ipsy points, I don't know. So I thought that was really cool of them that they did that, they didn't have to, but they definitely did. I didn't even complain, they just caught it. So that's really cool. Okay, so the shades in here, are you a peach, all dolled up, and heartbreaker. The packaging's real cute. I like this sassy little Betty Boop right there. And then we open this up here, and here are the shades and a nice little mirror. Looks like they're all blushes. Mm. They're not like super creamy. They're all fairly light too. That one at the end is very light. That might be a highlighter on some people. I don't know that I love the color scheme. I feel like if you had a deeper skin tone, this really wouldn't work for you. I have a very fair skin tone, so I can probably get away with it, but a lot of people are darker than me, so I don't know about that. What does this retail for? $28. Okay, next thing is by Jules Smith Beauty. Never heard of this brand. They are vegan and cruelty-free, so that's awesome. This is Power Gloss, Namaste All Day, and Serene Queen. Adorable names. Don't love lip gloss. I've been getting a lot of lip gloss in these subscription boxes this month, and I'm not here for it. Like, I don't know. I just don't like lip gloss. But here they are. They are very pretty colors. I will, of course, swatch them for you, and I will definitely try them. Like, I'm not going to knock them yet, but ooh, they smell florally. Weird, okay. Oh yeah, that's a thick gloss. Ooh. <laughs> this is, you don't see the names on them? Oh, Serene Queen. And then this one is Namaste All Day. Love that name. They smell the same? I think they smell different. Weird, okay. Yeah, it's a thick gloss. Let's just, let's just do it for the video.
Mm-hmm. Not sticky, which is great, but she thick. Like I can feel that on my lips. It is what it is. Okay. These retail for $32. Okay. Opening this box, I was like, eh, but now I'm seeing the prices, I'm like, okay, this is this is a I have a pricey box, but Moving on to the next product. This is this guy. This is by Tristique. I like the hollow. Um, this is a powder stick. All over Starlighter. Starlighter? That's a different language. Travel friendly glow on the go. Do you have a shade name? Glowy frame and vegan. Oh, ultraviolet. So this is going to be purple. Don't know how I feel about that yet. Oh, it's so cute. Tristique's products are the cutest ever. Like, I love the little pencil looking things. I especially like their lip products, the way they look. Not my favorite lip products, but I love the packaging because it looks like a um, crayon. My foundation oxidized hardcore for some reason today. Maybe it's just a lighting. I don't know, that's cute. <laughs> okay, so opening it up, it is like a little twist up and it's got some really cute stars on there. I'm smelling everything. Ooh, that's purple. Ooh, I don't know about that. We'll definitely try it out though. <laughs> How much is this? This retails for 18, no, yeah, $18. And the last guy in here, I see Tarte, what are you? Don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. It's falling. This is a Tarte High Performance Naturals Chrome Paint Shadow Pot. Exciting, this is in the shade Martini. Um, when these came out, I really wanted to try like all of them, but they were ridiculously expensive if I remember correctly. Yeah, $22, and I was like, I am not spending $22 on a single eyeshadow shade. Packaging is gorgeous, but, oh, okay. There's like a seal thing in there and I just dropped it, but for sure I will use this. Oh my gosh, yes. That's stunning, it looks wet. I am so excited for this. And look how much is still in my finger, like. How much is still on there? Crazy. I am very, very, very excited about this eyeshadow. I cannot wait to try this, honestly. But that's everything, you guys. Let's do a quick little recap. Um, the Tarte thing, super stoked. I really like this product and I'm very excited to try it. The highlighter, I don't know yet. I think it's really cute and I'm excited to try it. Maybe a different shade would have been better, but I'll try it. I guess I don't even know if they have other shades. The Betty Boop palette, packaging gets an A plus um, color payoff. Not here for it, but I will definitely try this out. It might perform better with a brush, sometimes they do. The makeup bag is whatever, it's cute. Um, the Lip Gloss Duo is a cute product to get. I like the packaging a lot, and I think they look really pretty, but I'm just not a lip gloss girl. I never have been, you guys know this if you've seen any of my videos where I complain about lip gloss in all of them. <laughs> and this I'm not excited for at all because it's not cruelty free. If it were cruelty free, I'd be really excited, but it's not. That's your brand, get your shit together. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Hmm. I don't cross on my channel, but I just did, so that's a fun time. Stay. Okay, that's everything I have for you guys today. I am starting to get delirious from the amount of videos that I filmed, and I still have one more to go. So if you guys are still hanging in there with me, good on you. I'm sorry. <laughs> but yeah, don't forget to like this video before you go. Subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on any more of my videos, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.